give thanks and praise to the Most High, Creator of nature. We do give thanks and praise. Order of Canon Law. To talk about give thanks and praise to the mystic laws of the universe and its protective functions and forces in nature that guide our thoughts and our hearts and our ways that are lawful, correct, and positive. We do give thanks and praise. Yeah, so when they must say ecclesiastical law. I'm going down upon the biblical level. And I think I am of the view that this is where the subtle usurpation may have taken place when them promulgate or express this, you know, say, ideology across the earth. Bear with me. So let's look at title one. That's the ecclesiastical law. Now, Canon 7, it's a, a law is established when it is promulgated. And You can say promulgate mean to promote <clears throat> or make widely known an idea or a cause. Example, these objectives have to be promulgated within this organization or within the organization, which is its organization. So, this is how law, their law is established. This now have nothing to do with the Ten Commandments, you know, people. This is where they must, you know, bring forward their alternative. And it's just my opinion, all that we have our own. Canon 8, section 1 say, universal, again, universal ecclesiastical laws are promulgated by publication in the official commentary. And I must say this, the same way when you see it as structure, churchically, at the very same way structure, governmentally, uh, it's an administrative, you know, process is when them create them agency that's why I'm saying government of Jamaica is an agency. And we, you know would demonstrate that. So it's saying you know, that the act of apostolis K said this unless another manner of promulgation has been prescribed in a particular case, even the word particular mean specific. Or it can be secular, put it that way, or administrative. That's why them say particular, they might be specific. So if the law for this field or area as, as such, then it now go apply nowhere else but in other area. But this is how them start them thing. This is why the canon law, how we have to go bring forward. Yeah. So since, you know, it's the game that is being played and we are being forced to participate, then I could express myself as best we can. The very canon law of a breakdown. I must say laws. 
Okay, let me finish now. They take force only after three months have elapsed from the date of issue of the act or the actor. You know what I mean? Unless they bind immediately from the very nature of the matter. So you say these laws can be binding immediately from the very nature of the matter. Or the law itself has specifically and expressly established a shorter or longer suspensive period. You know what we are talking about you know? Now, the must say the law, particular laws, universal law, promulgated three months. So now, them say particular laws are promulgated in the manner determined by the legislator and begins to oblige, meaning to compel, a month after the day of promulgation unless the law itself establishes another time period. We'll go on to Canon 9 where it says laws regard the future, not the past, unless they expressly provide for the past. And again, we are talking about the, you know, Ecclesiastical laws. You know? From here, so them break down to them, you know, administrative governmental agencies where you see. You no know, spend too much time here and other them can you know go through these things. You know, and touch upon the juridic the person and the juridic person. Particular laws, Canon 13. All right, hold well, on, put a step up on. Canon 10 said only those laws must be considered invalidating or disqualifying, which expressly establish that an act is null or that a person is affected. When you say the word affected, that a person is affected, that some person are the cause of whatever it is, not the one where it has a your injury me or affected. This is why you say the words, if you look upon the definition where the document itself are used. So the administrative side, we use a different kind of terminologies. You know what I mean? But usually it's synonymous. But, you know, they would, you know, it's deceptive out there. Canon law, all right. And when them say only those laws must be considered invalidating or disqualifying. Right here now we can look at, we can look at, The Charter of Fundamental Rights and Freedom, Constitutional Amendment, 8 of April 2011. I will be on going up. What the fuck? See if we can from life and take notes on these things. You know? We talk about particular law adjectives used to single out an individual member of a specified group or class. You need to read from here. Specified group or class. The action seems to discriminate against a particular group of companies. 
So when you say particular, you know it means singling out, you know? Yeah. And then when we are touched upon the laws for regard past and future. Now this is where we have a breakdown and I said, boy, only those laws must be considered invalidating or disqualifying, which expressly establish that an act is null or that a person is effective. Now, I said, Charter, char Charter of Fundamental Rights and Freedom, Constitutional Amendment, Act of the 8th of April 2011, Section 13, Subsection 2B. It said, Parliament shall pass no law, and no organ of the state shall take any action which abrogates, abridges, or infringes those rights. And the rights, for them are talking about our, you know, inherent right where, you know, right to life, you know, right to liberty, which is freedom of movement. Right to you know security in a person that means say uh, you even your juridic person have those rights. Cause it is a person according to these laws, and we're gonna show you the canon law where you have person and juridic persons. And you're gonna discover say uh, accordingly, it you know represent you with a physical character, right? say physical and juridic person. So it's just a step by step process. One them can look upon these information and be used for themselves, you know, accordingly. So go on again to say Canon eleven. Merely ecclesiastical laws bind those who have been baptized in the Catholic Church or Receive into it, possesses the efficient use of reason, and unless the law expressly provides otherwise, have completed seven years of age. So even if you're not if you're not baptized in the Catholic Church, are you not receive none of these things? Just the mere fact that you complete, you're above the age of seven. The universal ecclesiastical law bind you. Yeah, this is why you say in a certain situation, these justices and judges, them only use the canon law. And if you have to bring a claim against an attorney, the, the, the disciplinary committee are going to give you a list and I'm going to ask you which one of these canons the attorney violates. Again, according to our basic knowledge and how we apply ourselves, we have shared this kind of information. We now say, hey, this is the law or this is everything. No. We are say we only have share the basic information where we attain and we are bring it across from our perspective, from our point of view. You know what I mean? Whether wrong or right, this is our presentment. So when we need for correct any things, then at least we present something so it can be corrected. So bear with us. Bear with us. Yeah, man. So whether or not you profess to be a Christian, because at that time the Christian dominate everywhere. It's a unless law expressly provide otherwise, have completed seven years of age. Now, most people read and totally ignore the rule of English grammar. Now, listen again. The ecclesiastical law binds those who have been baptized in the Catholic Church or receive into it, possesses the efficient, uh, the efficient, use of reason and unless the law expressly provide otherwise have completed seven years of age 
So we can direct these people to the canon law. We are bring out the canon. So we are bust it on them, you know. Canon we are bring forward. Canon we are bust out, yeah. But remember, you know, we remain lawful and correct. And if we fall short of that, we don't have no problem or set hand here. You know, make we make the correction so we move accordingly, lawfully, correct? So we have to bring out a big gun for them. We have bust cannon. I want to tell you, you know, I want to go get that cannon. You know? Yeah, man, I write in our location. You know? Write up a forum, then we just go and see one big old cannon. I say, hey, then we have them thing here. Yeah? Like, you know, we have fair clap out there. Yeah. It may seem a bit more effective in a, this arena. Canon 12 section 1 says universal law binds everywhere all those for whom they were issued. Universal laws, you know, my people, bind everywhere all those for whom they were issued. Section 2 says, all who are actually present in a certain territory, however, are exempt from universal laws which are not enforced in the, that territory. Remember, I you know, our pledge, what the man for Jamaica said before, God and all mankind, so that they can under the ecclesiastical jurisdiction. And when we say, to God be the glory, or the same ecclesiastical jurisdiction, on which you I guess this would have been the secular order. So if we talk about law, it has to be the Ten Commandments. And I'm quite sure the Catholic Church know about the Ten Commandments. And them know about the Sabbath day. For them for reverence. And them choose to do their own thing. So we are point out these things. Say, boy, them are try to enslave the living soul manifest as man. And it won't happen. You understand? It won't happen. We will, you know, present a juridic person. You know what I mean? We will not try to capture. But the paper, we can always have that. Yeah, man. So, it has a Section 3 is a laws. Laws established for a particular territory bind those for whom they were issued as well as those who have a domicile or quasi-domicile there and who at the same time are actually residing there without prejudice to the prescript of Canon 13. Now, Canon 13, Section 1. Again, particular laws are not presumed to be personal but territorial unless it is otherwise evident. Now, if all the administrative law is presumed not to be personal but territorial, this is why I say I'm not no jurisdiction over the personal. And as we go along, we're going to discover that so we have a public juridic person, which is the all capital entity. And the private juridic person would be the up and lower case. You get me? That I went over some sign saying, come on, Dallas. And when you talk about a personal, that I just Linton hyphen on me, this is when we attach them together and that's all. Given name. So when we make a signature or a signing according to how you have to function, we right? have Linton hyphen O'Neill with a comma to separate these things. And then it's a Dallas at the end. So the Linton O'Neill is the executor over all of these things. But sometimes, if in a walk, walk for your experience, you will never be able to express it. You understand? Uh, if you just hear some things and you yeah, do some things and you know you know, know the foundation of the things and then how you're gonna qualify the thing. 
my life me you know say when well, I can show them that they gave me and most of the Republicans and the sign of Lincoln on the hill you know Dallas three names the surety very same way however when you look at the birth registration form which is the only entity administrative agency can interface with can interface with you have to realize or you shall become cognizant that my actual name which is in upper and lower case is not on the document I mean and I I, I mean just create a make a tape and present my birth certificate, my birth certificate information. So that people say, yo, we can publicize and public, public. Listen, once a public agency, foreign agency, have this information, it can never be private. The private side for me is when you take action and affect and effect the public record. When you affect the public record, when you cause the change to make for the public record, but that for the private side, are you the living man only can do that. Just like how with this birth certificate entity, it's only the living man can make a plea to that. But for them PC to me, I may have the, the, the bond paper where everybody says it's a debtor and the surety and indentured, all of these things, with all different kind of processes according to the foreign agency. We know we're upon this location, but we don't know nothing about these things. We are so we free and we're not allowing a piece of paper to enslave me. And if we're not a part of an organization or corporation or an agency, then Absolutely none of the rules or regulation which are legal standard from a statutory instrument piece of paper. There's some money, some foreign people, not us. Create. So when we use a canon law, it is a little bit more expressive. You understand? We go down even to say Canon thirteen section two. Travelers are not bound. And one said, subsection one said, I the particular laws of their own territory as long as they are absent from it unless either the transgression of those laws cause harm in their own territory or the laws are personal. So all I'm on like highways are traveler. And I'm just not transient, and I'm just a traveler passed through this earth. Yeah, man. Who could I look at that provision? However, provision to us by the laws. Travelers are not bound by the laws of the territory in which they are present, except for those laws which provide for public order, which would which determine the formalities of act or which regard movable goods located in the territory. Now, let me talk about the constitution and within the constitution the contract there is the charter of fundamental rights and freedom which bind these people their obligation as public trustees out there. Yeah, man. So they are them can touch upon these things. Let me try to get to the 
Title six physical and juridic persons. Notice the caption says physical and juridic person. It not say or it doesn't say physical and or or physical or it has a physical and juridic person meaning. It's enjoined. Physical person is adhesively. It has a apart. And in or the juridic person. Yeah. Is joined in together. It's not one or the other. That's what we get from just looking at that. I'm read it. Physical and, or should it say physical and or. These are specificities. And they are get specific. So it's a chapter one. Canonical condition. Physical persons, you hear that? Canon 96, it said, By baptism, one is incorporated into the Church of Christ, Christianity, and is constituted a person in it with the duties and rights which are proper to Christians in keeping with their condition insofar as they are in ecclesiastical communi communion and unless a legitimately issued sanction stands in the way. So them say, once you're baptized, you're incorporated into the Church of Christ. So that can be a general statement. Any baptism, so even if the bubble shanty, have them little organization and them say, boy, you know, ordain your high priest and baptize you and thing. Them thing they apply, stand. You know what I mean? Any little group, it stands. Because the lawyer, once you baptize, it never say baptize in the Catholic Church. It say once, I watch this, by baptism, one is incorporated into the Church of Christ. You know, say so into Catholicism. Now it's a canon 97 section 1. A person who has completed 18 years of age has reached majority. Below this age, a person is a minor. Now, when we talk about attaining the age of majority, you know this new construct legal system, this foreign Babylon thing with them about them. With them legal thing. Age of majority is not determined by this. Age of majority is determined by you have kind of knowledge to take total control over this juristic, juridic side of things. However, with the canon law, it will make it no straight say a person who has completed the eight. The 18 year of age has attained the age of majority. Canon 97, section 2 said, a minor, and then and them say a person below the, the age of 18 is a minor. Now, a minor before the completion of 17 years is called an infant. Again, Canon 97, Section 2, say a minor, before the completion of the 17th year, is called an infant and is considered not responsible for oneself. And this uh, non-sui compose is a Latin. 
with the completion of the completion of 17 years, however, a minor is presumed to have the use of reason. It's only a presumption there. Uh, a lot of it as complete. 17 year and should, you know, attain the age of majority, but we lack the reasoning ability and we ignore logic. So, the canon has said, a minor after them complete, after the completion of the completion of 17 years. Is presumed to have the use of reason. Now, when I go to Canon 98, section 1, it says a person who has reached majority as the full exercise of his or her rights. Again, no matter about persons, you know, and this can be you, the individual man. Because they might do them things this way, they become person, you know, this way. Them can give you a legal or a statutory definition in order to facilitate their construct. So, again, a 98 section one say a person who has attained the age of majority has full exercise of his or her rights. Now, why, when you are supposed to have full exercise of your fundamental human rights and freedom, you are being regulated by a foreign system operated by a, a very local people who is totally unaware of their actions, their unlawful conduct. And it's unlawful only because I have declared, I have renounced it from this agency and this foreign body politic. Politically, I have no interest, but I'm not hear me because the money is too, you know, enticing. Then always I attack your bond. Always I go after that juridic person. You get me? And then want you forgot the prison for the juridic person when once you are cognizant of what it is, you present that rigid juridic person and address it. Just like how we said we are the executor and the beneficiary to this piece of paper. Because we have this piece of paper in our hand, it is with 90% possession. And when we can express, as I have, an effect, a public record, as I have, then naturally, I don't fix for myself. And I may fear telling myself or more about them for me. We are sure yes at the moment a person or a man has attained the age of majority, a full and complete exercise over any rights whether out there. And his duty is to exercise those rights. That are the man duty, you know. And if there is any infraction or anything at all, we apply to the man and bring it forward. But if you can't bring somewhere applied to a juridic person. So it's a juridic person, person with that S at the end. Don't take my word for it. Look it up legally. Should come up 
points that in the video are organized. No, no, but yeah, man, physical and juridic person. So then, you know, right here it's the joinder. So if it's the or, you know, then you don't know it's one or the other. But right now, in a them thing, in canon law, they must show you say, a physical person, a juridic person is joined together. This is why we create what is known as a separation of entity. The physical is separate and distinct from the juridic. The physical man is separate and distinct from the juridic man. Because the juridic man now exists. This is why they use person and then they use man. Because they cannot have jurisdiction over the man. The man of God, but the more and purport themselves as God and to the worship as God and sit down at the mount of the congregation as if they are God. And they are not the righteous there in other earth. Rebut that presumption. They are not God. How can you? irrespective of whatever rules and regulations they promulgate out here, think it can apply to the true and living man when it do not, and we are demonstrating that. Sympathy, however, to me, you know, sir, them have them technicalities, because I remember when I go into them school, when them bring them witness statement and them have some come in within 42 days with a, with a defense. So mother said, boy, I can't speak and all these things. That's why I said them play with them court date like that. And them, you know, policies and processes. It's called them legal process. However, when them give me a recognizance, I place a document and them court. So me can't ever late for court. Me can always go out two day before the court and day before the court. Me can do the same thing. You understand? Because me already place a document upon the court. Them of it. Them might say, hey, I'm not going to show no registration. Why? Because I'm not going to stamp duty on the document. That can be arranged. And that shall be arranged. Because I may prepare a document for a court in paperwork. You understand? Say so technicality now go apply to me because I'm not a board member. You know what I mean? Yeah, the legal standard out there can't apply to me. Not under threat, duress, and coercion. This is why you notice to appear. It's fraudulent at the first instance. So you never care me before a court of record and issued that bond. And I wasn't issued a bond before a competent, competent parish court judge or a resident magistrate. And a beautiful police officer will issue this document to me. She made me know, say, I have to sign or I won't get out of your incarceration, your lockup, or your detainment, or your arrest, or your jailhouse. I wouldn't be able to get out. That in and of itself is threat, coercion, and duress because even when yeah, after you have got through this thing, it's just that. Most people know that these things are born, but they will not be able to express it this way. I remember, and if me a law break, I'm going to break any law. <coughs> Where there is a valid victim of any crime, then I wouldn't be doing this. 
You understand? If me go beat up a man out there because I feel like I can beat up a man and bully a man and yeah. I forgot through the process of being prosecuted for my wrong actions, then I would not be doing this. Because the victim of a dead has evidence that I bring hurt and harm to that man or woman. Or I have destroyed their property. Or I have in some kind of way take away everything them have fraudulently. Outside of that, where is the crime? If there is an officer and then Morgan, number 17034, is bringing a claim <coughs> of a witness statement, which is a complaint, which we all know is like him or so me. That's the whole process. He is bringing a suit against me, a claim against me, a statement against me. So this young constable, I'm going to bring a suit against me on behalf of his senior sergeant of police, who is a coward, Sergeant A. Edwards. But he didn't write the report. And I, tell, I say to the public, so if this sergeant in, 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 in may not be a bad man, he may not be one of those kind of, you know, out of order man. He may be even a religious man. But the fact still stands that he cannot read and write properly. And if he could, he would have write that statement. So they bring up this young constable who is eager to, you know, experience all of this. But young constable, show me where have I offended you, my good brother, my good young brother. Where have I offended you for you to be bringing a suit and having your own agency behind your back defending your unlawful conduct? I'm not disputing the fact that I do not have a license or a certificate, one count, one count, two count, three count, four. I don't know. All of that is true. However, who does all of that applies to? Not I. Does not apply to her. This is my point. The jurisdiction cannot be personal, but they give me a personal recognizance bond. If you got number one, the moment you have to stop my vehicle and, you know, say, boy, I'm not up to par. I'm going to show you, sir, but I'm not supposed to come outside of what I want to deal with. And that should be enough. However, you ignore that. Yeah, the police officer ignored that. And we did show him a certificate of fact. Duly signed and sealed. With a renunciation. But it's like them I said, so make him demonstrate. We're we'll gonna demonstrate the enslavement. Uh, if you people out there are gonna follow these oppressors and when them draw you in a them thing and you figure out this is what it is and you remove yourself like oh me cancel my voters registration and give them back all of those things. Just like how oh, I renounce it from the political body politic that they have right here, which is the government of Jamaica, which is an agency. So that means that irrespective of how I do it, just don't apply to me. Yeah, it's new to you people. Yeah, it's strange. Yeah, I am the man where I bring it forward. It now have nothing to do with me being an Awak Indian. It now have nothing to do with that. 
it now have nothing to do with me being associated with no organization. It have everything to do with me being a man. True and living soul manifests as man according to what is written out there anciently. So this man, I say you do not have no jurisdiction here. Now, if you're going to say territorial jurisdiction, you're going to rebut that again. You being a foreign agency cannot claim no jurisdiction here. When you talk about your jurisdiction, look within your document. It's always for a specific location. Like your, 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 your Kingston area on a newly formed. Your corporate areas, you know where it is. So this is, you know, we are express ourselves in a, our basic way. Yeah, man. As a base people, trying to apply ourselves to get to the basic level and move on from there. It's right here, you know. I cannot wear a bus, you know, you know. Whether I want to like it or not, I'm going to clap it up on me. So if I never try to come with technicality, I go impatiently get my stamp duty. And place this within an accord with a few other documents. You understand? And then leave you people to do whatever you people wish. But I'm going to choose, now that I'm cognizant, to participate, you know, in no unlawful arena. You know, choose to break the law of the most high creator. You have to wait until I break the law of the most high creator. Then you can subject me to a secular mess. I'm not being rude. I'm not being out of order. And I don't think <coughs> anyone should accuse me of having an attitude problem when they speak my truth. My truth, not necessarily correlate with yours, but this is our truth right here. Physical and juridic persons, no, it's physical and or juridic person. I have a fine set. Well, let's take a time on brother. It's a minor section, remember Canon 98, section 1. Say a person who has attained the age of majority has full exercise of his or her rights. Section 2 say a minor in the exercise of his or her right remains subject to the authority of parents or guardians, except in those matters which minors are exempt from their authority by divine law or canon law. So you see, the divine law at the Ten Commandments got to be, or canon law, you see the use of words right here, it must say divine law and canon law. It's one or the other. There's option here. So when it's a physical and juridic person, there is no option there. You understand? It's just joined up. And this is why we humble ourselves to the divine law of the most high creator of nature. But we're going to use a canon law to adapt them to deal with and adapt them to go by. Because it has set up for them construct. Because this is how the administrative construct everywhere functions. Yeah, at the top of freedom thing, pyramid, at the ecclesiastical law that is codified in canon law, which is a universal law. However, they are aware of the divine law. Again, with us, they are the waiting. You know? Later, when we find the errors, we can correct it and we still move forward. 
But if we not come forward and present it, then there's no discussion. You understand? There is nowhere for us to say, boy, make a reason so we can look at things and use logic. You get me? So it's logic, rhetoric, and reason. Put it on that level, you know? If it not follow, if it not flow, then we can discard it. This is all me I do, you know? Just ap apply my basic trivium to it. Anything at all. So here we have it where them say from their authority by divine law or canon law. So any other else law of a subject themselves to these two laws. You understand? Or the divine law, the ecclesiastical law are derived from the divine law. However, it's secular. Uh, them, you know, them kind of break it down to facilitate to take over your soul. Like, well, at least your spirit. You can't touch your soul. So the person, you know, the juridic persons would be that spiritual aspect right that's why they have lord spiritual and lord temporal this is how babylon snatch you you know but we are so free down it not means uh, you know we are got mars we are so free dominion free dominion remember you know demonic forces out there dominate the earth and have it as their dominion. Now they move under the same with the people of the earth. But they already spoiled the most size people. You know, spoiled it to the point where we're clueless of who we truly are. We're clueless that we are derived from a perfect source of power. Not the imposter, not the imitator. The creator. Yes, sir, we are derived from him. That's we are or doxy, ribot, euclid, acid. It's formulated by people. Consanguine, this is why all when all are with upon this earth, uh, pay attention. You're not going to be the same. This is why they have different, different groups. Collectively, we are earthlings sharing the same earth, sharing the same air where we are breathing. Uh, we're in the same life force. Yeah. But when we take it from the physical level, we're going to see all kind of differences on the physical. And we're going to have different, different, it has a aggregates, a group in. However, consent, yeah, consent is required by even the Mosai creator. When he might lay out in divine law, he never impose it. He said, watch ya, I man have a group of people when I choose for myself according to what he did. No. Everybody else have all kind of gods out there. What the book said, you have a set of people who I choose for myself. But these people don't know I. 
But the moment these people look to I, remember I, then I will bring them back to memory of the love. So the books are in. People, we have problem with books. This is why they put a lot of information inside the books. It's just that the moment they discover, say, once and once to be able to ascertain the truth, then you say, the book writing become common. Where anybody can sell them write book. Any little anybody. Yeah, they're not for qualifying, not at all. They're not for have no form of experience and they're not record history. You know. They're just a write book about fear. You have all kind of slaves to write books about freedom and being free when they are, in fact, in truth, in slave. So you say the distraction and the misinformation, the miseducation. This is why the earth is out of course. Uh, when truths cannot, it looks strange. Yeah, man. So, in this time, it's more stranger than the fiction where the map of earth are here. Yeah, man. But again, people, you have your public, you have your private, and you have your personal. This is how they must structure. Uh, they want to govern the public, and they want to usurp the private, but they can't touch the personal that belong to the most high creator, the man. Anyway, no one this thing will take too long. You know. But them thing here is really expressive, you know what I mean? Check out the code of canon law, people. Uh, there is so much more to it than just, you know, what we were a scratch the surface. We got this stuff as uh, religion and where you keep. It, it is not what most people think it is. Yeah, man, religion. Is not what most people think it is. You know what I mean? And theology or something else. All I foreign to we in my people. All I what we have talked about and shared with I'm on the information that I man bring forward will never be taught in school. You won't find it in university. Other people such as I out there, what we call autodidactic, self taught people, the ones them will never go, the ones them where you can look on old tapes, you see when them can people speak properly, and you see the development. You can look on old tapes, you see some them can people read and write properly. And as time progresses, you see the development. These are the autodidactic, the ones them were untainted, the ones them will never go in and out foreign institution and get molested and then come out to purport themselves as something great. We are talking about the grassroots kind of people, the self-taught kind of people. The, the, the people who keep an autonomous kind of perspective when they allow themselves to be indoctrinated. Them kind of people, them kind of people are the truth seekers. The one them when I got to stay rigid and hold on to whatever they think they know as true. Present me with some information for me to correct myself. I shall correct myself and move forward in truth. And I righteousness, which is a clean hands and a pure heart, simple. No Abra Kadabra. No, just the most I creator of nature. When a man say I want fire for us, we're going to have sun. When we want charge for the sun, we're going to When I some people see me nice sun, no I charge. May I charge the energy. 
That's it. Why a lot of people complain and run from that sun? Everything in a moderation. So this is only the truth of the most high creator of nature can make us all free. Not just the truth. So even I, as I move forward, and have an issue correcting, yeah, myself, and have a problem stopping and correcting, I of to love their self introspection people. They look and see what it is and why is it and how is it and of whom is it. We have to have our mirrors. So when all demonic forces we attack a man like I I know it's only an opportunity. To manifest the most I create as glory within the earth. And remember, it has already been written, says, good over evil. That's the point of victory. Good will prevail always over evil. This is why we now have all these years a smooth week without me. Why it is written that way. Good over evil. So I know of a problem. I fear how much time I will rise and fall. Like when I go at them, and I rather fear in you know, this cause of righteousness where the ultimate victory is such. Then again, any kind of victory and win, knowing that we are at the end of destruction, at the end of failure. Uh, what may I do is wrong, morally wrong, ethically wrong, lawfully wrong. Now, we are to stand up in our high righteousness according to, you know, the body of knowledge, what we have mass over, our little, you know, show the existence. As man. This is why we express for self that we are living soul manifest as man. Irrespective of all these other distractions. Yeah, man. So people can, you know, check out them kind of information at like, all. Uh, and a joke information. And this, once we start studying them, code of canon law. Yeah, we are at least edify ourselves in a way that we weren't before to the black people. And that is part of growth. That is what we call improvement. That is what we call progress. And of the have Three, four cars in your driveway. You call that progress. When you're blind as a bat. You know what I mean? Yeah. If you have dumps on all of your license plate, dumps, like all some other people buy dumps, but they make them call it brand. And you know, give it to them dumps here. We in a choose to correct ourselves, then we will never be corrected. This is why I'm in a minor improve. I'm in a minor say, oh man, I'm sorry. I need that. I apologize. Not that problem. Though. Bring it forward. But we have to choose to make a change. It can only manifest within us. It can only start with us as individuals. Babylon celebrate the bad out there. So if they are so going with beer badness and talk about beer badness and badness and badness, then my channel will get hot like fire. It's a 
subscribe or comment in you know, one of the things and I say, yo, how come this this video not get a lot more views? What's going on? And when he said my laugh, cause it's just before he said I look on the YouTube information and, and I look on the video at 71 and I climb to 77 and I say, wait, how oh, my video them start moving so now before it never moves. And as I said, I said the thing flip and go back down to 51. And I'd be probably still there 51 or just a move from there. So I can't pay attention to these things. The inf the, you know, the important thing is the information we share. If the ones them out there will resonate with, they get it. Yeah. 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 Yeah.